my campsite was over there and I'm not the last one out of camp I might actually be the first one but uh rain stopped the trees are still pretty drippy it only got down to like 50 degrees I thought it was going to be colder today I'm going to see Ramona Falls and then tomorrow plan to see Tunnel Falls so getting a fairly good start to the day up from that way there's another big camp area over there had a few people in it but it wasn't crowded I'm heading up that way so the trail goes this way I'm not sure what parking lot they're talking about I didn't see it on the map but I want to go check out Ramona Falls it's an alternate and I don't think it actually adds any distance, but it does add a bit of uphill. But it'll be totally worth it. And we're going to get some sunshine today. My tent is wet, but the rest of my gear is dry. And the smart thing to do would be to get the tent out at some point and let it dry, but I probably won't. I'll probably get to camp tonight and have a wet tent. from that way and going up that way Coming from there. We're going in there. down there got a couple miles of steep that's all right going up there because my pack is light so I came from that way and that goes on up to Mount Bald or Bald Mountain and I'm pretty sure I'm heading this way. So that two miles of uphill was like two and a half miles. And it was over 600 foot of elevation per mile. And my calves are feeling it. <clears throat> Coming from over there, getting some sunshine. I don't know if you can see the steam coming up. 
So maybe sun shining on the spot that I want to camp tonight and I might have a dry spot. Coming from over there. Heading up there. I'm um, starting another like two miles of uphill not as steep as that other I'll tell you that knot in my right calf came back and it's gonna be I don't know generally uphill for quite a while after that two miles so I'll check and see do I take water or do I just drink what I have it's like four miles to the next water coming from that way I got rocks that way. Coming from that way. Going up that way. Coming from that way, last little bit, the trail's been on what looks like an old log road grade or something. It's been very chill, and I'm hoping I'm making up some time where I can get to my campsite before it's dark. Bunch more trees that went over and took the roots up with them. Coming from over there, just barely peeking over. Heading over there. And there's some rock coming from over there. over there and there are some rocks coming from that way there's a ridge right here that I've been going along for a ways uh, sometimes steep sometimes mellow it's about five o'clock and the temperature's down to 55 degrees it's getting a little bit chilly
coming from over there. And heading up there. was right up there and uh, six o'clock and I'm a quarter mile from where I wanted to make camp which means I did make up some time because when I started this morning I thought it was going to be seven o'clock before I got there and then after I did that really steep two miles up it looked like it was going to be like 7 30. It's Friday and the, where I'm going is known to be popular so I hope it's not crowded. Kind of surprised to see somebody camping up there on the point. So I'm taking the Indian Springs Trail to the Eagle Creek Trail. Coming from that way and I was confused at first because I thought it was the you know the Eagle Creek but uh and saw these branches here and I remembered, oh yeah, that part of the trail is closed because of a fire. So this is the detour. Now, I didn't get to do this detour in 2017 because that part of the trail was on fire. But I see a couple of spots without uh, rocks and, and it's not crowded. I'm kind of surprised. That's the way I'll go tomorrow gonna set up my tent see if I can get it to dry any before I go to bed and there's a spring just down the trail so then I'll go get water and I'm gonna get to sit at a table to eat tonight well I know it looks like it got wetter while it was in my bag uh, by the time I put it up yesterday some of the outside had dried but there was a lot of moisture inside from my breath condensing. But I've got plenty of time. Well, I don't know, plenty of time. Maybe about an hour before it gets dark enough that I'm going to want to definitely have my bed roll set up. All right, let's go see about some water. This is it. It's a spring. Try to figure out where I think the best spot to collect is and then get to make a dinner. Well, this looks like a better spot and it even has a picnic table. I didn't see it at first. I saw this little side trail come down from the uh, behind a trailhead sign. I was like, well, let me go check that out. 